Hello everybody and welcome back to, well actually I shouldn't say welcome back, I should say welcome to Western Australia, welcome back to another stream. Um, so yeah, this is hopefully going to be a very exciting stream because, well, it's all very big scale and I always do enjoy playing on these Australian maps because of the scale, absolutely huge, big machinery, expensive stuff and well, it should just be thoroughly enjoyable playing with my subscribers in the server. So yeah, if you want to join you can do, 16 slots, there's only about 8 of us in so far. Um, if the synchronizing becomes a problem I'll have to just switch off the ability to join but yeah there's definitely space for a few more at the moment. Anyway the chaser is, the chaser bin here is pretty much full but we do have the mother bin over at the side of the field so if I just cart over here I should be able to unload into the mother bin and get things on the move but what we need to do really is have some more combines that would be ideal. So I think, yeah, at the moment we're just going to keep going with what we've got, but, yeah, if more people join, I can lease some more machinery, because we only have £42,000, which isn't a great deal, but having said that, as soon as we do sell this massive load, um, it's going to be good. Yeah, I think what we should be doing is using the chaser, this chaser, to cart from the combines and put it into the mother bin, and then the trucks should be taking it from the mother bin to then take it over to the cell point, which is a very long way from here. This map really is gigantic. It's called Western Australia, if you are interested. Wow, that actually doesn't... I think I'm on the wrong side. Am I on the wrong side? I am surprised it doesn't reach over. That is, yeah, that is incredible. I think I need to just readjust. There we go. Uh, okay, <laughs> seriously, not actually unloading to there. Okay, that's interesting. Robert Thomas, keep up the amazing videos. Smashing it as always. Well, thank you, Robert. Um, yes, just just failing there. Casually failing. But, yeah, it wouldn't be a Dagwin stream if there was an absolutely no fail at all. If it doesn't work, I'll just put it into the trailer. Let's just test this. Right. Okay. Maybe we do have to switch it on or something. Anyway. Yeah, we can't we can't stop over such a minor technicality. Andy K is here, ready to take everything over to the cell point. So that's what we'll do. Uh, yeah, as I just said, it is the um, Western Australia map. No, the server is definitely not full. Loads of space. So definitely, if you would like to join, just head over to the Discord, grab the download link for all these mods, and you will be able to join. Oh, is it because it's not on a tractor? That is a possibility. That is definitely a possibility. Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> any reason why that's not working either? Everything was working before, I'm sure it was. That's just weird. It's going to be something fairly simple. We'll try another one. Take three. Is that seriously not going to load into any of these? These are all base game machines. That's interesting. Okay, well, I've got all of my subscribers here. Or some of my subscribers. So, ah, oh, there we go. That's working. I was going to say, yeah, somebody's bound to know, but... It looks like it's just a positioning thing. You've just got to get the positioning right. That needs to be lifted up. There we go. Perfect. Okay. You've just got to get the uh, correct angle. Um, okay, so DJ Go Ham Gaming, have a great stream watching from the States. Thank you to you, DJ Go Ham Gaming. Um, yeah, it should be good. It really should. That's going to fill this lorry completely from empty. This trailer. Um, yeah, it's all working really well now. So, great. So, I'm going to have to go back over to these combines in a minute. We do have three. I think it's three on the go. I would like to get more. Amazingly, nobody else has joined in the whole time I've been streaming so far. It's like, what, three minutes? Seven minutes? Um, yeah, nobody has uh, joined. I did think it would fill up instantly, but I guess you've got to download the stuff. It does take a little while. It's like 250 megabytes for the map. So that has totally filled it from empty. Time to go and put the remaining amount into the back of Andy K's trailer. Put an angle on that. There we go. So yeah, I don't know why it didn't work before. Maybe I can put it into the mother bin next time. Or 
Almost there. Great. Uh, so I do actually still have 1,229 litres. I will attempt to do this once again. I really don't know if it's going to work. Oh, it is. Great. So, yeah, just for some reason, it decided to have a moment of, of not working. But now it is going to work. So, yeah, I think what we should do is just keep this chaser over at the combines and then keep everything else at the side of the field instead of having everybody in the field. But, yeah, I've got no problem at all uh, with having extra combines on the go. Am I ready for the update tomorrow, says uh, maybe Mexican. Um... Yeah, definitely. I've just got to download it. Uh, one thing I do like is the... Um, oh, it looks like we're going to have to unload in the crop. I don't like doing that, but it is a stream, so it's not too much of an issue. It's not super realistic. Yeah, I just need to uh, get it downloaded, and then we can try out that really nice new feature of being able to use the landscaping tool for putting grass in, and it puts it onto the first growth stage instead of just having the texture. There's actually foliage, which is always good much more realistic. Yeah, version 1.3 comes out tomorrow, the small engine show. So that should be good. I think there's a bit of a delay though for Mac users, that's my understanding. Um, they did actually post something on the Twitter, so yeah, if you're on Mac, then expect some kind of delay. Not too sure, I don't think it's a very severe delay, it's just like a few hours or something, not too sure. Uh, yeah, there's no crop destruction. This is not supposed to be realistic. Okay, so that is the first one done. I need to go over to Farmer Sergeant... Is it Sergeant? SSGT Tom? Okay. Just need to get aligned. Still using the SATEC wheel, but my G29 replacement did actually arrive today. So I just need to get that set up and hopefully it doesn't squeak. I think that combine is completely full, but as soon as I've unloaded a bit, it should be able to co just continue. Um, unless we're going to do it on the... No, we're not going to do it. We're just going to stay here. Okay, that's fine. Um, Dagwin, do you live in Bedfordshire? Nope. Alright, the chaser bin over there, the mother bin, has moved. I'm assuming that three of these is going to fill it about two-thirds. 66%. But I don't really know. Apparently Andy's blinkers are on. Hazards. Right, let's get out of this crop. We're going to have to go back into the crop in a minute. Here we are. Lord Banana. Okay. Ah, oh, right, we've got somebody joining. We've got Weasel. So, I'm getting a question there saying, how long am I going to be streaming for? either until I get bored or until it is the time which is midnight so the other day I had to stop because of another reason but I'm hoping to go to as close as midnight as possible close to midnight as possible I don't know if it's gonna be uh, I mean <laughs> it's gonna be a relatively repetitive job what we're doing here because it is such a massive field and I will actually show you the minimap in a second um, you'll be amazed if you've not played on this map before you'll be absolutely astonished it is big. It's a very, very vast map. Yes, and I think it is going to be about two thirds, as predicted. So it looks like we've got about 826 viewers. That is very impressive, as always. Uh, thank you to everybody who has tuned in. Hopefully, I don't bore you this evening. I do try my best not to. <laughs> Oh, look, we've got somebody else joining. Yeah, as I mentioned, if we do get too much synchronizing, I will just put a cap on the amount of players that we can actually have in the server uh, just to you know not keep it too bad but luckily everybody does seem to be synchronizing fairly quickly which is always good still getting quite a few people saying which map is this this is the Western Australia map and there was actually a Western Australia map for FS17 and I really did like it so so pleased that there is a Western Australia map for 19. Uh, I didn't actually do a let's play on it in 17, I did the cinematic videos. I had to stop doing them though because it was it was an absolutely incredible amount of time they took to make. The finished video was like 7 minutes or something, 7 to 10 minutes, 
and it was easily taking five or six hours to make, longer than survival roleplay by a long way. So, I just yeah, I just couldn't do it. Um, looks like we've got a load of people leaving. Don't know how many. I just see many people saying goodbye in the game. It could just be one player. I think it's Luke. Yeah, it's Luke. Right, so hopefully this time it's going to work, because it did work at the end of the previous load. Yeah, perfect. It looks like it might be a bit sensitive, like it has to be in the correct area, either front or back. Right at the front of, or right at the back, one of the two. Um, the name of the song at the beginning, I think it was called Starfields or something? Pretty sure it was, but it's by Epidemic Sound. Hallman. You should find it. If you type in Hallman, you should find it. Right, so this is a replacement player. Is Chainsaw 100 still around? Yeah, he puts a video on every day, I think. Uh, is the video fuzzy? Nope, not at all. I can see that it's going out with a good video health, so just put it to maximum resolution if you can do. And uh, yeah, it should be good. This may take some time, despite the rapid unload. And look at this, literally a drop in the ocean. Well, not literally, it is a drop in the ocean. If it was literally the drop in the ocean, then I wouldn't be unloading into a, a mother bin, I'd be unloading into the sea. Um, has that stopped? No, it's still going. It's just transferring across to... That's actually quite impressive, we've got that into that into that. <laughs> that's probably going to fill it up completely, actually. Um, have I ever been to Northern Ireland? No, I have not been to Northern Ireland. Are my videos 4K? Unfortunately not. I always get quite a few of these about um, who is better, PewDiePie or T-Series, and I don't know. I don't watch either of them. I literally have no interest. Oh, so I'm so sorry, John Deere Mad. I have just, I've just taken the lid off your tractor. It's like lifting the lid off a can of soup. Okay, those combines are going to be ready for me again, no doubt. So if I could go up here, uh, it's going to be a long time, but yes, if I go up here, I should be able to unload fairly soon. Um, oh, thank you for that very kind comment there, Robert. How dare you? What, that I don't like either of them? I'm going to add an opinion. Uh, right. The chat seems quiet. I guess it's because of the uh, slow mode. The epic Dagoin driving strikes again. <laughs> Every video, yeah. Horrific driving, guaranteed. That could be my slogan. Anyway, there is um, a point of interest here. It's like a, a mini island with a gum tree on it. Try and get Dagoin to... 500k. Unlikely, considering I have lost 10 subscribers in the uh, 16 minutes I've been streaming. This combine's full again. Oh. Yeah, that's the thing. The Satek wheel, it's alright. You can get by with it, but it is just... Yeah, it's a bit slow. Oh, I, I, I've lost two more subscribers. I know what it is. I know why I'm losing these subscribers. It's because I said I don't like PewDiePie. I've got nothing against him. I just don't watch his videos. <laughs> I do like him. I'm sure he's a very wonderful person. I just don't watch his videos. How full is this? Uh, right. Keep up the excellent work. Thank you, Kevin. So that one's full, empty. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting full. Um, zoom in front of here. Subbot. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how many people use subbotting. It, it seems like a fairly you know, pathetic way of gaining subscribers. I wouldn't even know a channel which is doing it, to be honest. You can tell my subscribers are genuine when you're losing 10 in, in 10 minutes. Yes, I've lost one a minute. Great. Um... What's the link to the what? 
Oh, you'd have to search Google for that, for the tree planter. Search Google, you should find it. Oh, yeah. say you like PewDiePie and you'll get them back. Okay, okay. Okay, PewDiePie's videos are great. Uh, let's see if I can regain 10. Uh, it's unlikely. I think the damage is done, to be honest. Did you see the new Kubota Versatile Tractors? No, I didn't. No, nope, uh, I don't really know much about versatile tractors to be honest do you play Fortnite? nope I'm just saying no to everything it's great <laughs> I just have to say no anyway that is once again 51,300 litres so not full but I'm not going to be able to get another load into there so I'm going to have to go and take it over to the mother bin um, I might also swap jobs as well in a second to go back over to the truck and trailer so that I can obviously show a bit more of the map off instead of the same section of land. Uh, you must like trees because there is an awful lot of leaves here. Okay, I like trees. Um, I don't know, Chris. Hello from New Zealand? Hello. Yeah, can you see the map? You certainly can do. Here is the map. It's impressive. It is. Uh, this is the field, field number 11. This is where we currently are. And, well, it is just... <laughs> it's, if you look at the size of the rest of the map compared to the field, it's big. Adam, thank you for your super chat. And thank you to anybody else who does a super chat too. Really appreciate it. Do you like Matthew Ferguson? Yep. Oh, don't you dare break your nose streak. Oh dear. I've just I've just broken it. I've had to say yes. I just I just can't say no to it. Uh, okay, let's keep reading some of these comments. We ever play FS15 again? Uh, can't guarantee it for a video, but I would revisit FS15 just to play on uh, some of the older maps because some of the older ones are really good. There are some which actually died. Some maps died when 17 was released. They never got converted over. Okay, let's hope this is going to clear it. Maybe I shouldn't have put that up so soon. Alright, just ramming my way in. Yeah, I'm just going to do that again. That was not a very graceful approach. There we go. It's better. Hello, Moon. Alright, okay. The chat has certainly warmed up. I can. It's got to the stage again where I can't actually read some of the questions. Uh, this this is called the Western Australia map, not the Australian Outback map. That's a different map. Look at that just transfer. I could just unload it straight into the the trailer here. We do have, or at least we should have, the the RKW because they're really good trailers. Uh, yeah, RWT. I should have said. <laughs> uh, yes, these are good. So as soon as I have got the money, I'm surprised we don't have the money actually. Where's all this grain going to? Ah, I didn't do a question mark. Yeah, I don't know where the money's going to. I'm almost empty. Perfect. Right, does anybody want to swap? Is anybody here watching the stream? Do you want to swap? Weasel? Possibly. I'm not going to force him out of there, but I'm just going to try it. Oh, thank you. Great. Okay, so we're going to be going over to. Is that full? I think that's full. Well, it's almost full. Uh, we're going to be going over to the cell point, which is. Let's go and take a look. We've got a load of wheat here. Um. Oh, Dylan, thank you for that. Hi to you as well. Western Australia Grain Company. I need to put a marker on that on the map. It is in this general direction. I am here. And somehow I need to get to here. And it looks like it's just, you know, across the map. Probably a good 20 minutes drive. <laughs> that is an exaggeration, but I wouldn't be exaggerating 10 minutes. Uh, yes, I definitely need to keep the minimap open for this. This is going to be tough. I don't know how long it's going to take to cross the map, but 
it's going to be a while. But at least you can take in the sights. We have some electricity pylons here. WR Rural, recovering from surgery. Thanks for the stream. Oh, we'll get well soon uh, and appreciate that. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure what the surgery was on. You didn't say, but yeah, hopefully you make a speedy recovery. Hopefully you're out of hospital too, because hospitals aren't the nicest of places. I, I don't like them. Wrong way already. Nah, it's not. You're trying to fool me. This is definitely not the wrong way. I'm going to cut across whenever we get to the next road. Unless it does just end up in the middle of a field, in which case it is the wrong way. Never played the map before, though. Some old abandoned cars there. Some water. Oh, McDougal is joining. Okay, uh, I'm playing FS17 instead of 19 today. This is from all four farm bros. Uh, logging with FDR and my edited logging equipment. Nice. Oh, look at this. Got to cross some water. Although I was going to go. I was thinking. I was thinking that was the road. So yeah, I'd be driving down the river. Probably not the best of ideas, to be honest. Hmm. Ah, yeah, that would be the way to go, wouldn't it? Still, I reckon I could do this. I reckon if I go just around the field, I will get back to where we were. There we go. There is a track here. So we can definitely do it just going cross country. This may take a while, but... I think I do prefer this over going the direct route on the main road. There's more to see. I might go back the faster way though. You can't turn off slow mode, that is set by me. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not it's not possible to turn it off unless I do it. Oh yeah, we're definitely going the scenic route. You thought it was a video, yeah. This is this is live. It did actually make it much more difficult to prove that a, a video was a stream when they did that premiere thing. I don't like it at all. Um, but yeah, it acts like a. It makes the video look like a stream because you can comment live and stuff. The idea is great for something which needs to premiere, but most videos don't. So yeah, it can make it very confusing. So I would only ever use that unless it was something which would really fit in with a premiere, but one of these videos wouldn't. Not at all. Uh, I'm still getting loads of people saying which map is it. I should probably put it in the title, but it is called Western Australia. Well, Shipony says I've watched every video and stream since Court Farms. Now that is dedication, because Court Farms was 15, I think. A long time ago. Right, I can see my marker. I can see the cell points over there. Has anybody been timing how long it's taken so far? I know I did go wrong. It's a completely flat and open map and I still managed to go the wrong way. These things happen. Horrid... Matek, does it say? Don't you get bored of playing Farming Simulator every year? Yeah, I do. I do get bored of it from time to time, but when a new map comes out or a new mod, it's like a new game again, so yeah, you've probably been able to notice uh, the times when I have been bored. It is possible to get bored if you play it every day, um, but it really does just renew it. It makes it fresh again when there's a really decent map out. Like this is fun. It's a different map. It's a place where I, I never really go, so the idea is great. Anyway, yeah, Australians driving on the left, so. Oh, we've got somebody in the middle of the road here. Weasel. Now I think we go to the great big grain mound over there. Pretty sure we do. <laughs> yeah, it's going to take a while to get here. Uh, do I play any other types of games? Yeah, definitely. 
Yeah, I definitely do not only play Farming Simulator. It's fun in the time, though. I used to play much more. I don't play video games as much anymore. So here we go. Up the auger. Leighton Barber. Love your FS videos. Uh, keep up the good work. Thank you to you. Much appreciated. I think that's unloading underneath. Yeah, I want to change trailer now. In fact, what I'll do is... Well, if I can do I'll try and sell this one trailer. What is it? It's a distinction. Okay, so if I choose the distinction... Right, okay, we have two. I'm at risk of selling the wrong one. I don't think it tells you where each one is. Ah. Um, yeah, that's right. So I did get the wrong one, but luckily it doesn't allow you to sell it. Trailers, and we'll go across to RWT. Purchase that. It is, I think, smaller, but it's still good. Spark Cycle, uh, good to see you here. A regular Super Chat donator. Hi Dagwin, thank you for the surprise with triple episodes from Letton. Can't wait to see how the night in the cabin has been. Oh, you don't want to know. The night in the cabin. Not good. But thank you. And yeah, the triple episodes. Yeah, I just I just thought it'd be great to do a surprise. Always fun to uh, surprise your viewers. Because I know that most people do prefer that over anything else. Okay, I've gone wrong. I need to go this way. Yeah, most people do prefer the... Let's go over here. Survivor Roleplay over Marwa Mana Farm or any of the other FS19 videos for that matter. Okay, the uh, <laughs> I've actually got something to blame here. This is the steering wheel. Satek steering wheel. It's got a super high degrees of rotation that you can't change and I usually don't have such a high degrees of rotation in FS. I could reset the truck, that's true. I wasn't going to, but... Um, I think everybody's waiting for me, so I'm going to have to. That was it. Oh, that was it. I can't tab back. There we go. Yeah, so it's a good looking trailer. No, Jeffrey, it's not. Not sure if that's a joke. Hodge, hello. Evening Dagger, uh, keeping watch on the chat tonight. Thank you, Hodge. I've seen a few. There's been a few which need to be looked at. Yeah, this is the yard. It's a really decent yard, loads of space. There's Weasel. Um, yeah, and I think everybody is waiting for me, although I'm not too sure why exactly, because they have the mother bin. So they should be able to unload into that. But anyway, yeah, I head over there. Get the cover open. I can see the chaser bin. There is the mother bin. So hopefully, it's just going to be a case of going straight underneath it and getting it filled up instantly. How full is it? It looks like it's not very full, um, but that could be more than you think. Yeah, there you go. Rapid fill. Full in a blink of an eye. So, this time I'm going to go the proper way. So, over the top and far away. Hi, Dagwin from United Kingdom. Hello, Night Watcher. You've not travelled far. I'm from the UK too. Please respond to my direct message on Instagram. I don't have Instagram. You direct you 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 direct messaging some random person. Uh, a Tusker. Wow. Uh, just here to say hi. Well, that's more than saying hi. So thank you so much to you, um, a Tusker. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh, yeah, massive thank you there. Really, really happy to see such generosity.
It's always incredible. It always takes my breath away when somebody does like a really big super chat. When all I do in return is sort of crash into stuff and flip vehicles. <laughs> I guess you are donating for the cabaret. Not too sure exactly. Uh, oh, Coca-Cola. I like Coca-Cola. It's good stuff. Bad for you though, I think. Can you do FS17 roleplay livestream? No, that that would probably ruin it, to be honest. It's a good idea, but I think I'd ruin it because it's a it's a tricky one to perfect the survivor roleplay. Right, so it's a nice straight road. Don't have to do anything. I think I'll just sit here, have a nap. Oh, did I get those subscribers? I didn't, did I? No, I didn't. I've still lost those subscribers. When I said I didn't watch PewDiePie, I lost ten subscribers, and they have never returned. Never to be seen again. You can actually just about make out the uh, pile of grain. Let me just do this. Five. Put a five on it. Ah. Uh, ah, yeah, there you go. You can just about see it in front. Past the cab. Let's just turn it off again. Absolutely flying. Oh, no. Wrong side of the road. Who's that? John Deere Mad. Ah, your name. <laughs> your name is very fitting. Um, yeah, driving on the left here in Australia. Same as the UK. The correct side. But I think we're on. Yeah, we're on left-hand drive. So that doesn't really work. We need to have, I suppose, more of a European tractor unit. Yeah, so delivering 59,477 litres, and, um, oh, there's a bit of bit of fun for everybody there. Um, anybody got a forklift? I could do with a forklift. <laughs> oh, great. Um, ah, good. Uh, I think I, I might have just, um, well, yes, I did just approach this a bit too fast. Um, it is potentially possible. <laughs> It's possible to get that uprighted, maybe. Um, if I can get, <laughs> I, 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 oh, it, uh, this is ruined. If I can get this up, it, I might be able to get the trailer up, possibly. I need to get the tractor unit up first. Okay, um, I'm going to go and lease or buy a wheel loader for somebody to grab. We, we, oh, we've actually got one. We do have one, so that's all right. If anybody could please <laughs> just bring a wheel. Oh, it's going to take forever, though, isn't it? A wheel is going to take absolutely forever. Hmm. Oh, actually, there should be two two trucks on the go. John Deere Mad was the other one. So when he comes back, he just needs to drive into me. And I should be uprighted. Although I'm making progress. I'm actually doing an impersonation of a crab. I'm moving sideways. It's also quite a good time to inspect our prop shaft. It's all looking very good under here. Nothing to see here, just crabbing around. I'm very slowly getting away. I know, I'll hide in the bush. Everyone will just think it's a, a random trailer. Oh no, there's John Dean Mad, hide. Nothing to see here. I think he's, see he's seen me. He is seeing me. Probably watching the stream anyway. Blame it on the lag. <laughs> that would be good. Except I have absolutely no lag at all. Um, yeah, uh, My hiding didn't really work. I think I've been spotted. Pretty sure I have. Yep. Thank you. And now I've just got to get this uh, trailer up. I think probably just ram into it. That would be the best thing to do here. I might need a bit of speed. Right, here we go. It is full, so that doesn't really help. Although, yeah, nice. Great. Thank you, uh, John Deere Mad. Did you come back empty just to upright me? It looks like you did. How embarrassing. Nightbot is not a real person. Hero211. Uh, Nightbot is an evil, evil thing built into the server, into the chat, to uh, 
basically get you muted. <laughs> Not really. It's there just to uh, stop any spammers or abusive people. Right, let's get this thing sold. Yeah, technically, that should have all come out, obviously. If farming simulator was more realistic, my grain would now be all over the dirt track. Oh, we've got somebody joining. Not many people have joined, I am surprised. The, oh, that tech kid YT. Yeah, a virtual moderator, very good. Some people do take a while to join, others are really fast. Yep, I'm still doing Machinery Restorer, it's going to be the future. I'm going to be doing quite a lot of stuff on there, so uh, stay tuned. I'm hoping to do a wide range of different things, so some really small stuff, and also some fairly big machinery as well. Obviously the big machinery takes a very long time, plus it's very expensive, um, so, well the time is the biggest problem. There won't be many of those videos a year, um, but there should be quite a few smaller projects as well in between. And Nightbot has just posted the link to Machinery Restorer if you are interested. Anyway, yep, almost sold all of that. So that's put the money up to 123,768. Pretty good. Uh, I can see Anne is trying to ask or is asking how we're gonna how you're gonna join the server. If you want to join the server, the best thing to do is to go over to my Discord and you should find all the server details there. Failing that if you go, well actually that is the best place because there's a direct link to all the mods, but yeah. There is a link on uh, my community page as well. The Duelist. Hello Dagger, how are you doing today? I'm doing really well, thank you. Uh, the Duelist, hopefully you are too. Yeah, Follow Me is coming out soon too, so that's going to be a great addition to the game. It's going to make this game so much better. Such a good mod. Follow Me is just one of the greatest mods in my opinion. It made 17 what it is because of the ability to do so many different things with a worker alongside. And you could do all kinds of crazy unrealistic stuff too by having a number of tractors and uh, implements following each other doing ridiculous things. Did I go out of there? Hang on, I I've managed to get lost. I've I could have done. I could have gone out of there, but I think I'm going to go over the top. There is also a vehicle here. It's a weasel again. Ah, it's <laughs> on the way to upright me. Uh, spark cycle again. Uh, well, I have to go to bed. Uh, I have farming school in the morning. Drive safe. Thank you again. And uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. And enjoy farming school. I think I might have taken the long way. I'm pretty sure I have done. Uh, OP Nightwing 1. I love your videos. Thank you, OP Nightwing 1. I'm not lost. I'm, I'm definitely not lost. I know where I'm going. I'm just going in this general direction. Follow the road and eventually you might end up at your destination. It's unlikely, but it's one way of doing it. Yeah, there's the Coca-Cola sign. Yes, I've definitely been here before. Yes, that's right. I've not done much first-person view. That's better. See, it's all very highly detailed. This game is detailed. although it does get a bit laggy as well in first person. For whatever reason, first person is laggier than third person, even if you've got the mirrors set to something really low. Right, this is the field. There are the combines, but I need to go to the mother bin because it's most likely the fastest option of filling. Chances are I've got quite a lot of stuff over here. Oh, I've actually got that wheel up as well. That's probably one of the reasons why I flipped over. We'll get that down. There we go. Yeah, there's still room in the server if you're interested. If I just take a look here. Okay, I was going to have a look, but it's now synchronizing. 
Somebody has joined. The Machinery Restorer channel. That is my other channel. I have several cha Well, I've got Machinery Restorer, Daggerwin, and Daggerwin Extra. Can you change your map and do Peterville? It's not out yet, so unfortunately not. Yeah, as soon as Peterville is out, I'll start it. This is taking a while. I'm not too sure who it was that joined, because I was on the escape page, which means it doesn't show you. Right. Oh, we've got three spectators. It is quite full. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. There's still space for three more people. Three more players can join. Oh, actually, we've just lost McDougal. So, four. Anything in there? Yep, rapid fill. It's a very impressive fill rate, but that is not full. My trailer is not full. So if I go over to the combines, I should be able to get a full load from there, hopefully. There's the wheel loader. And that's lagging. When will you finish the Tamiya Volvo? I finished that ages ago. Uh, if you want to see the final part of it, you have to go to the Christmas special, 2018. It is at the end of that video. I don't know why it's gone laggy all of a sudden, because it all seems to be alright. OP Nightwing again. I've been your videos for three years. I can't remember. How many years have I been going for? It's Yeah, oh, wow. I have... Uh, that's not good. Did, did I push the combine all the way over there? Oops. Um, what, what's going on there? Why, why is it so laggy? Yeah, I've been going since uh, October, or well, 1st of November 2014. Sorry, um, whoever I crashed into. That was terrible. Thing is, I don't seem to be showing that much lag, so I really don't know why it was so bad. Anyway, I'm full, so it's time to go over to the sell point. Is it still the best sell point, though? Because supply and demand and stuff does seem to be. It would be nice to go to a different one just for variety, but they're all, they're all very close to each other. I'm just wondering if I can tab between any of these places. Yeah, the only way of actually exploring this piece of the map is to drive there. Although what I could do is fly. So if I if I do that, go up here. It's only going to give you a very brief idea because of the scale, but yeah, you can see. It's a bit like the minimap, really, just from above. So there's all those electricity pylons going across the map and then we've got all these other fields this is all we've done so far it's a big field the headland has been done surprisingly huge there's the farm over there if I just zoom in uh, there it is there's the farm so yeah it's massive sorry if that's going to make you feel dizzy uh, let me just zoom out again Right, four from the sky, very, very slowly. I've got my parachute out. No, I've been held in the air. Somebody has joined. Uh, yeah, thank you uh, about the shift and tab to go backwards. I do that all the time, but I can't do it when I'm streaming because for some reason, uh, when I'm streaming, it opens up the uh, Steam overlay, which I still haven't changed the key binding for. I should do, because it is frustrating. Okay, just uh, busy levitating in the air. There we go. Oh no, I'm going to be fed into a combine. Great. Uh, there goes my truck. I guess I... Yeah, I deserve that. It's gone so laggy for some reason. That is strange, because it doesn't... doesn't seem to be showing lag. So I don't really know why it is. 
This is completely stuck. <laughs> uh, let's just hope it calms down naturally. Can we? Oh, we might be able to afford a truck. It might have to be leased, unfortunately. Hmm. I'm inclined to go for a European one. But it's still left-hand drive. Why is that left-hand drive? The Hyper Monkey. Hi, Dagger. Loving FS19. What is your favourite map? Mine has to be Mercury Farms. That is a good map. Um, there's not been many so far which I've even played on, but uh, obviously Mara Mana Farm is very good. Mercury Farms, from doing my first video and from playing on it in 17, uh, is definitely a really decent map. I do like it. Um, so yeah, that's, that is definitely up there. It's one of the best ones so far. Uh, Peterville I have obviously toured, and that was very good. And then there's ones like Australia. I do like these maps, they are. For some reason, satisfying to play on, despite everything being so large. Um, so, yeah, I don't think I've got a favourite, but all the ones I mentioned are really good. We're going to need a trailer. We could do with quite a few of these. I think we'll buy it because I don't want too much stuff on lease. It's just going to become ridiculous. So there we go. Going for the Challenger colour. And we've got somebody else joining. I think a lot of people are now going to join. Makes sense though. I was not expecting it to sink so quickly. Okay. <laughs> Uh, right, let's get over there. Is there anything in these silos thinking about it? Because I think the first loads were definitely taken here because we were getting absolutely no money at all. So something must have been put in the silo. I've done that thing again where I go almost close enough but not quite. I have a bad habit. Well, who was that behind me? Wow. Made me jump. Just a random tractor who is following very closely behind. Uh, yeah, definitely. We've got half a million liters here. So I don't know. Why <laughs> I don't know why so much was put here. Yeah, this is going to become crazy. I'm going to have to cut off the uh, synchronizing. Unless it's full, in which case I don't have to. Although to be fair, that wasn't really too much of a problem. That was super fast. Yeah, so as you can see, we have got a lot of players. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. And possibly some who are not in a farm. Yeah, 14, 15. So there's only one slot left. That's fine. We can we can live with that. Dagwin, could you do a video on how to change left and farm? Many get into the game. I don't think I understand the question. Um, how you change? Oh, it's done in Giants Editor. Yeah, whenever. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, whenever I. <laughs> no, <laughs> I was reading the chat. Uh, yeah, whenever I do anything, it's all done in Giants Editor, so I can get out of the situation. Because of course, this situation happens all the time. Biggest restoration I've ever done was definitely the Kubota. Yeah, the Kubota B twenty one hundred, massive restoration for me. Obviously it's only a compact tractor, but still big and very expensive. I reckon they put these banks here to stop people from taking shortcuts, and uh, yeah, somebody took a shortcut. Let's just go through here. That's better. If you can't find the server, your game is either out of date, or you, you're lacking a mod, or you've got a filter on. Seriously? I can't believe you can't do that. This thing's supposed to be an off-road truck. Good job I've got a tractor behind. Uh, what out of 10 would you rate this map? I would rate it as... Probably an 8. Which is good. It's a very good rating. It's literally almost impossible to get a 10. Because that means that it's absolutely faultless in every possible way. Thank you to whoever that was. For freeing me out of my incompetence. Okay, so yeah, we're going to go over to the same place again. Uh, I actually have no idea if I'm going in the right direction. Probably not. Uh, I think it's actually this way over here. 
It's all a bit of a blur because we've got so many players in one area. Uh, oh yeah, there's me. <laughs> there's me crossing the field. Well, hopefully, there's going to be a way out of here. Hopefully. I need to find some way of getting out. Uh, possibly easier said than done. We will see. I think this is alright. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so if I just uh, continue up the road. This is going to be quite a long journey and I'm, I'm swaying. I'm swaying. Wow, this thing is unstable. The other one was pretty good. Yeah, if you're on the wrong version you won't be able to see the server. You have to be on exactly the same version. Uh, plus, of course, everything's updating tomorrow to 1.3. The server usually takes a couple of days. It's not done by me. It's done by the people who I rent the server from. So I've just got to wait until I've done it. Uh, so, you know, there might be instant, possibly. It could be instant, but I really don't know. I don't know why it's swaying quite so much, because it's not very heavy. Well, it's about 60 tons, but still. Yeah, if you want to join, you can do. There's like, I think, one space. Possibly one space left. It might be full. Which is rare. This server is rarely full anymore. For some reason, uh, in the days of FS15, it was just full nearly all the time. Whatever time of day you go on, it would be full. And... Uh, Obviously 17 was a failure because of the trolls, so I just shut the server down anyway, but 19, this server runs 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, and it is still, a lot of the time, completely empty, and uh, probably most of the time it has about 4 or 5 players in. Ben says, I don't like Felsbrunn because it takes so much power to run the map. I think actually most of them do take quite a bit of uh, power. Did you pass your driver's test, Dagwin? Yeah, I did. I got one minor. First time round. So there. Hard to believe, but yeah. Um, I get so many people saying, how long am I going to stream for? I don't know if that's because you, you're excited to watch the stream or if you want me to finish. Um, but yeah, I usually finish sometime between half past 11 and 12. Yeah, this thing's swaying. Chad, pocket change for you, sir. Thank you so much, Chad. Um, there you go. That's that's in return. <laughs> that was terrible. Um, yeah, thank you for the pocket ch pocket change. Um, it would definitely go towards the channel or the machinery restorer channel. One of the two. Actually, yeah, but this one, it all goes into this one. Andrew says, can I send you something to restore? Very kind of you. I don't have a peer box yet, though, so that would be tricky. I guess I could do, but the, the issue I've got is restorations take a very long time to do. Um, and if all these generous people send me stuff, I feel I would feel very guilty um, because I wouldn't be able to do them. I physically wouldn't have the time in the day to be able to restore them all. And then it would kind of look like you've sent me something and you'll never see it again because I don't have the time to do it. So, I don't know. I don't know if I should ever do that or not. It's it's definitely a possibility. But I don't want to upset people. It's always my concern. Right, there's a good bit of money in. £39,000. Um, Cyrexial Havel, is that? I hope I pronounced that correctly. Uh, hey buddy, keep up the awesome videos logging. Uh, yeah, we could. Well, actually, if you're interested in logging for single player, I'm going to be doing that very soon on Mara Manor Farm. Um, as for the streams, it won't be today, but it's definitely something we could do in the future. The reason I don't do very much in live streams is because, for some reason, in multiplayer, I always have uh, a bit of an issue with the log sort of lagging quite a bit, so it's usually quite tough to do. But yeah, I'm definitely doing it on Mara Mara Mana Farm. That's a bit of a mouthful. 
very soon. Uh, that's actually mounted on nothing. Literally nothing. Uh, <laughs> even when I get to my destination, I get stuck. There we go. Right, let's get another 30 something thousand pounds in. Will you record multiplayer on Saturdays like you used to? It made it a lot easier for me to know when to join. I did do that, but for some reason, uh, in 19, whenever I put a, a multiplayer video on, it just gets seriously disliked, and I don't really know why. So I've stopped doing the uh, single player episodes. I really don't understand it, because I used to get loads of uh, good comments and stuff for multiplayer. Everyone looked forward to it, but now it's just like, ugh, it's multiplayer. Hate it. Dislike. So I, I don't know. Uh, does the Anderson log loader have a winch on PS4? As I have not even tried it out for PC yet, because it's not out, I don't know. Uh, I doubt it. I don't think any of the base game machines have winches. Um, so I would say no, at a guess, but obviously I can't say for sure. I wouldn't have thought so. That tech kid YT, thank you for joining the server. Goodbye. Left before I could say, maybe you're watching the stream. Um, is it hard or complicated to make the videos on Letton Farm, or would it take much extra time to do them? It definitely takes a lot longer to record, yeah, and to edit. Depending on the level of uh, what I'm doing in each video, it takes anywhere from an hour to, f to record to two hours to record, and then anywhere from half an hour to edit to two hours to edit. It all just comes down to what I have to do. MJ Modding, welcome! If you've just tuned in, then uh, well, you've missed quite a lot of horrific driving, although that probably won't come as a surprise to you, <laughs> as that happens in absolutely every video of mine. Um, yeah, as I've said before, it wouldn't really be one of my videos if I didn't end up on my side at least once in a video. In this stream, I've been completely on my side. I have crashed into one of those electric poles, and I have done a, a few jackknives. Yeah, I've done like three or four jackknives, so it's going well. You can tell it was totally overloaded before, though, because this is not swaying at all when it's empty. It feels really stable, and then when it's full, it's like all over the place, like a jelly. Ah, and somebody on the side of the road. Hello. Everybody just seems to appear out of nowhere. Uh, that's a good question, Michael. I don't know. Ryan says, I like your survival. I think. Always nice to hear. It just seems like such a popular series, despite it being on FS17. But 17 is a good game, and it has so many decent mods too. So it just makes it easier to do more diverse things. Andy says, we have crops ready for you, Dagger. Great, I'm going to go and pick up the next load. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. That's in... Oh, no. I'm on my side again. Oh yeah, self-uprighting, that's good. Beep beep, come on. Who is this? <laughs> Somebody who's just trundling down the incorrect side of the road. Uh, yeah, so this is the field just here. We have actually, well I haven't, but everybody else has now got quite a chunk of the field eaten away. So, yeah, there's progress. But if you take a look on here... It's actually just going to be the slightest bit. Hmm. It's not updated. Don't know why. Uh, yeah, I'm back up. So the mother bin is here. We'll get the 
or possibly the final load actually because I've done quite a few now. Uh, the rest of it can be sold by everybody else or taken over to the silo. I love the fill rate though, that mother bin is just great. The fill rate on the mother bin. Uh, the mods you are what make this, yeah that's true, the mods on the survival series are indeed what makes it the survival series because you can just do so many different things. If it was just the base game machinery nothing would really be very unique it would all just be very similar so yeah you do need mods the modders are what keep the game alive anyway you just couldn't do it without modders and mappers they're great uh, I do not need to refresh my driving skills my driving skills are fine I've only crashed several times today How do you save the map from Giant Sailor to your save game? What I do is I create a backup copy and then I create a copy of that. I put it on my desktop and I open it up. I do another jackknife and then I open up Giant Sailor, save it and then delete the original fo uh, files in the folder, the, the zip, and transfer them across. I'm not a mapper though so there's probably a much faster way of doing it. It's just the way I've always done it, and it does seem to work. It, it could well be a very slow way of doing it. Anyway, yeah, as I said, the stream is going to be wrapped up in the next few minutes. As soon as I've sold this load, I'll be completing it. So yeah, if you've got any more questions, I can't guarantee I'll see your question, but please do post them in the chat here. No, I don't do shout outs unfortunately. Because otherwise everybody would want one. Oh, that's good to hear. MJ does it the same way. So, I've done something right. Surprising. Uh, dead zones. Yeah, dead zones are off. It's just, yeah. The, the, I think, actually, I'm not convinced, but the SATEC wheel, I think it has a dead zone anyway. Even if you set to 0%. Oh, look at its sway. It's just not heavy enough. Dagwin, you really don't like that man, do you? Actually, I do. I do. But I think the trailer is just too heavy for it, and that's all. I much prefer the European trucks over the other ones. These are great. But you see, in the UK, I think the maximum train weight is 44 tonnes. And I think we've got 60 tons just in the trailer. Okay, I have obviously gone cross country. So I need to somehow make it across here. Yeah, this trailer is far too heavy. There is a collision on the barbed wire. So <laughs> wherever it is, wherever the exit is, I'll take it. I have a feeling it's going to be all the way up here. You should move the Survivor Series to Air Island. I did consider it, but I think it would just be a bit too big. It's a good map, but I think it would just be too big for the survival. Here we go. Finally. Great. Uh, try running with a dual, not single rear axle. I mean, yeah, that's another thing with FS, actually. You can't have the twin axle. You can't customise it like ETS-2, which is a real problem, because this exact reason, it's just so unstable. So, there is so much more that this game could have in it. It could be improved, no end, but it is good. It is a good game. Steady. Steady. Almost tipping over. So we've actually made quite a bit of money today, especially as most of the grain has already gone into storage. If it had all been sold, obviously it would be much more. I was trying to figure out if this was a Weybridge. I don't know if it is. I couldn't see a display. 
Ah, uh, is it one? It's one you have to go into. In here, I think. Oh, it's for small people. I can't quite get in. Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's all electronic. I'm not too sure. Right. So. This is the end. Uh oh. Just about cleared. Uh, <laughs> right. Anyway. Thank you so much to everybody who has uh, tuned in today. Really appreciate it. And of course, everybody who's donated. It's going to be quite a good amount. Uh, when is the next Survivor Roleplay? It'll be on Saturday, most likely, but I wouldn't rule out one for Friday. So there we go. Uh, yeah, I, I think that is it. So anyway, yeah. How many... Uh, I think, yeah, I finished off with uh, four less subscribers than when I started. Because I said I didn't watch PewDiePie. So, yeah, I guess that's what happens. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. And until next time, see you again soon. Have a great evening. Bye for now.